I was breezing, battling bosses, the record is flawless Zero losses, till I came across this Thunder young piece who resided at the bottom of the sea Tractors and crack. <laughs> we are Power Up Gaming, <laughs> and this is Trivial Gamers. This is the only place on the internet where people say things that aren't true. Okay, so let's get into it. <laughs> Be cool, guys. So the rules are simple. Every episode, one person steps up to regale us with a crazy story about their fa our favourite thing, video games. This story can be anything from historical, current, or psychological. It can even be completely made up, and that's the point. It's the job of everyone else around the table to decide whether or not the story is complete shit. Now, the only per only the person telling the story has any clue what we're about to hear. Guess it right, get a point. Get it wrong, be a gullible fool. <laughs> so, this week, our mighty international fruit basket is made up by the Sultan of Ontario, JD Schmidt. What's up? The Sultan of Ontario. Because you're what? from Canada. <laughs> you're from Canada. I thought you were from Alberta, bro. Yeah, what am I supposed yeah, to was, say? Yeah, that was the joke. I'm ignorant. It's, it doesn't matter. It's all the same. Oh, okay. way over my head. <laughs> I figured you were going for that, but at the same token, I figured Down's way too dumb to get that. Yeah, well, you know, you're a dick, so. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Austin E. Free Flynn, or as his parents call him, Austin Texas Flynn. The queen of jump scares, Amber Coyle. And the crusty cob himself, Adam Lloyd. And finally, me, Harry Bowers. Hell goddamn Dorado. So, showtime. Ooh. In all my hosting power I've deigned, I'm going first to get the ball rolling. So, let's get on to the story. Are you ready, guys? Yep. Ready. As ready okay. as I'll ever be. Great. Listen. So, when I was a little kid, I used to dress up as Princess Peach. And this is kind of the, what kind of got the idea for this rolling, because I just thought it would be an interesting way to air this embarrassing story and just move on with my life in retrospective. So, Super Mario Advance was kind of the game that got me into games on my Game Boy, plinking away in the car, everything, and I was kind of obsessed with it. And now, side story, my sister used to like love dolls when she was a kid, and by extension of that, she used to love dressing me up when she didn't buy new dolls, she'd kind of take me as like a chemistry, chemistry, a lab biology experiment and just throw clothes on me. And then she'd kind of dress me up, put me under the covers mm. and like present me to my parents to their ultimate embarrassment and disappointment. So <laughs> eventually, as I was get, getting a bit older, as I was growing up, I started to like, let's not say grow balls, let's say <laughs> grow ovaries. <laughs> and so... This is so a I house episode, isn't it? Like, I think it is. No, I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> I'm done. So the only way that she kind of persuaded me to dress up as one of her dull patient things anymore was to kind of don the character of Princess Peach, so make it interesting and fun. So it kind of just spun off from there and she'd dress me up as Princess Peach. It wasn't the most um, professional thing, but <laughs> we got by and, and then a few years later I realised... And and here we are today, the man woman thing I am today. <laughs> so, what a way to start the show! I know. I thought I'd start strong, get the ball rolling. We're a boulder down a hill. Indiana Jones is running. So, oh boy, are we ready, guys? I'm gonna question time. Do we just go at it? Is it yeah. just like throw a piece of meat in the ocean and a whole bunch of piranhas come up and start eating it? <laughs> or Amazon? I don't know. Well, so, can I be the first? Piranha? Well, this is a PG show, so we don't typically use violent metaphors like that, but I'll let you okay, off this sorry. time, so oh, it's okay. <laughs> they were uh, happy piranhas. They're just going to help the piece of meat. Um, <laughs> I have a... F uh, I just ask one question, correct? Yeah, of course. Oh, no, you can ask as many as you want. You <clears throat> go, fire, fire, you're a machine gun. All right. Yeah. Are there picture... Is there picture evidence of this? Hmm. There is. Oh. But oh, he's thinking about this way too hard. You're the <laughs> yes or my man. You know, you know, I thought about this, and I thought it wouldn't. If I could show you pictures, that would obviously right. be it would take away from the spirit because obviously it would be true. The mystery has to be there. But well, when it is, the when does it does indeed turn out to be? True. I just imagine it being it false, but it's you as you them. are right now, dressed up as Peach. Like, look, <laughs> see, it's true. <laughs> you wouldn't, you wouldn't know though, because I'd still look. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing would be amiss. Okay, I have a little bit of chin stubble. 
You'll get there. Okay, I've well, got so a question. Am I, am I like Benjamin Button? Like, I'm going back in time. I'm slowly. <laughs> okay, sorry guys, I've got a question. Um, what what did you say your sister collected? You said it was a type of doll. It wasn't a type of doll. She was just kind of into these, like just the style of dolls. Basically, anything she could dress up really, because she's quite into fashion. She's that type of person. Oh. Tend to the clothing on. So I, I thought you said that she collected love dolls, and I was like, <laughs> love well, dolls. You know, oh no, I said. I, I, said I, I don't, I don't know any um, any young girls who collect those kind of dolls. <laughs> 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 the last the last person I knew who had one of those, he was in his thirties and God. just lived on a mattress. <laughs> she was a child. <laughs> Was and then she started collecting <laughs> all the dolls. Well, the mouths always wide open. Well, they were sh they were shocked. <laughs> I can never look my sister in the eye again. <laughs> Not as shocked as Harry was. How could you look her in the eye again if she dressed you up like Princess Peach? I feel like that's a eye contact breaker right there, bud, bud. Well, she used to be like the cool, the cool sibling. So, and she was the older one. So I kind of wanted to be my friend, but she didn't really like me. So I thought this would be also be a way to get her to like me. So, I was blind and desperate. So, did you? And then, how far did you go with this? Did you wear the underwear? I mean, let's be honest here. It's probably you're wearing a dress. Are you wearing like <laughs> leggings underneath? It, how far did this go? I dressed up as a doll, so I didn't get molested. <laughs> Okay, in, yeah, in my yeah. experience, the two aren't Dirty mutually mind. exclusive. <laughs> I need to change your intro name now, just uh, uh, <laughs> Adam. I have been molested, <laughs> just for context, so the viewers understand, listeners understand from like the off. The, this yeah. is what Adam they're getting. Pervert boy Lloyd. <laughs> no, Adam crying out for help, Lloyd. <laughs> Adam fuck boy Lloyd. <laughs> hey, that's my weekend name. <laughs> Oh god. That's what I'm called Amber, on did Tinder. You question? No, I uh... <laughs> She just pretty much I, accepts it I, as it I is. I have a question. <laughs> it all makes sense. Okay. I have a question that's actually relevant to the video game aspect of the show. <laughs> sure, go Super ahead. Mario Advance. That's the one that's Super Mario that's World. That's the remake of Super Mario 2. Super Mario 2 that's or Super Mario World? Remake. Super Mario 2. Two. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Interesting. <laughs> it just... changed my opinion mm. drastically, actually. So, mm. I'm good. I was... What does this mean? Does this mean you hate me as a no, person? No, 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 no. It, no, you... it just means... Uh, I'll, I'll tell you after. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. <laughs> just go, please. <laughs> All right. Um, my last question okay. is... When you dressed up, <laughs> allegedly, as mm -hmm. Peach, um, did you do the voice? I, did, I don't think we went that far. <laughs> Bear in mind that... At see, that point, I don't, did, I don't I think she like had a... Did, far, she didn't Harry. have a voice at that like point, though, right? I know where this is going. It was a... The, the whole thing was that I wasn't, I wasn't meant to be a living thing. I was meant to be an actual <laughs> doll. So the point was I stayed quiet. I think this is also part of my sister's <laughs> hatred for me. So you dressed up as a doll. <laughs> so the Peach. thing was like... I get put under the covers and it would be boiling hot, and then she'd go downstairs and she'd be like, "I'm just getting mum and dad." But really, she she it would take a long time. Well, it felt like when you're young, so I don't know what she was doing. <laughs> don't you dare say anything. Adam. So <laughs> I'm just waiting in the wings for my opportunity. <laughs> I've got a good one. Of... The sounds insidious by nature. I'm mean, hate to say it. It was a perfectly it's, innocent. It's, uh, it's going from whimsical yeah. to. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Well then, did she give you a ball gag or what? I <laughs> wow! <laughs> well, this oh, is the okay. thing that yeah, yeah. after fuck boy, ball gag is the one that gets Austin. <laughs> okay well, then. This is the thing that gets me about the story, though. It's like you know, she wanted you to dress up, but she didn't want you to be a human being. It was like you, no, you know, some sort no, of creepy she, doll situation. Because she was so into dolls that she, I was her next doll in a collection. <laughs> Like, <laughs> this sounds like that episode of Pokemon where Sabrina turns yeah. Ash into a, a doll. <laughs> I got myself a walking, talking. I like to think of it like um, in Toy Story 2, the collector guy who has Cheetos on his fingers and he's all... Oh, that kind of thing where she big puts owl. in the box. And... Think of it however you want. It's all about you sleeping at the end of the night, alright, bud? <laughs> Thanks, I, I think. think. <laughs> alright. So, any more I'm questions? I'm ready to go. 
Yeah, I think I've made my mind up. Okay then, so Austin, what's your verdict? Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm smelling bolt <laughs> from a mile away. I'm gonna say no on this one. Okay, our friendship's That's over. Bold. JD? Well, originally yes, I was going to say no because I thought that Super Mario Advance was the port of Super Mario World in which Peach right. only shows up at the very end. But considering uh, it's okay. Super Mario 2 in which she's a playable character, I'm going to say true. I like that. That was some good in-depth knowledge there. It's like you write about games. Sherlock, like... biatch. That's cool. Yeah. Go to Power <laughs> Gaming. Oh, okay. So, Adam? Okay, well, initially, I thought this was too ridiculous for you to open a show on, so yeah. I was thinking true, but okay. I've actually come round the other way now. It's the whole sort of doll thing. It's almost like you're trying to detach yourself from it being a reality, <laughs> so I'm going to say false. So what you're saying is really I was molested or something, and this is just how I cope with it? Yeah, it's more of a coping mechanism than anything. Okay. <laughs> you... Ugh. I'm glad we did this show, um, I'm... <laughs> I think I used to think highly of you people. So, yeah, I'm, cons I'm considering a career in psychology. Harry, we all love yeah, you here. Jesus. Amber. That is way too detailed information. And, you know, honestly, the same reason as Dell. I'm actually kind of saying this is true. You know, if you were just, like, bullshitting, that is a lot of freaking you know, detail to go into just for okay. a lie. So we have two trues and two falses. Ooh. Or can I not count? That's, no, that's, that's right. Correct. Okay, great. <laughs> I can confirm. <laughs> Do I get a star? <laughs> no, no you, get, yeah, you star. give the you're stars. The star, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, so... Austin and Adam versus Dallin and Amber. Mm, okay, so the big epic reveal. Like, uh, that wasn't epic, but you know. Okay, so it was actually a bold face lie. So. Oh. Yes! Oh. I knew it! <laughs> Sorry, guys. I outwitted but... myself. Okay. Thought too much about it. <laughs> if I can quote Ricky Gervais. I didn't think anybody you're was full of shit. Lie. Austin, jeez. Well done. You're talking shit, mate. You're talking shit. It's the worst what lie what I've ever heard in was my that life. Australian? That was Australian? That was a good impression. <laughs> Crikey. So, I don't know. Oh, that was an experience. Nice, round one. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> that was an experience. It would have been a better experience if you actually had dressed up well, you as know what? Peach. You know what? Fun story. They say the best lies are based somewhat in truth. Oh. It, it was it is ah. it was actually true that my sister dressed me up as a as like a doll one or two times. And that's how I've got kind of like the idea that like came the way. Yeah. So really, Really, I've lied to you all, but wait, no. So really, you were all right. <laughs> <laughs> now you're getting your crap all mixed this up. You don't know exactly what's going what on anymore. <laughs> but yeah, basically. So, all right. Uh, Dolan and Amber, you both get a point. No, 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 no. We said true. Me and Austin. No. Don't lie to me. Dolan and Amber. <laughs> Hang their oh, heads okay. in shame. That's the one. I see. I get confused. So many names. Points for names. Austin and Adam. Okay, nice. so Austin and Adam, one point to both of you. So, thank you, Austin. It's you up next week, actually. So we'll see how you fare in the in the livescape. So, congratulations to the people that got it right, and that was Trivial Gaming. The next episode will be coming uh, very shortly, so stay tuned for more. Uh, we hope you enjoyed yourself. Remember, we're a small site, so every like or subscription does actually help. So come to www.powerupgaming.co.uk or follow the Power Up Gaming UK if you want to read our content and witness us all being just a little bit less stupid. If you want to do some more following, Mr. Darlin Scomidita is uh, JD Schmidt 89 on Twitter. <laughs> I'm going to keep saying that now. And, and just finally, the amazing intro music you heard was brought to you by the supreme courtesy of the amazingly talented nerd whore rapper Megaran, aka Random. So go check out my favourite song of his, Wiley, because I just can't get it out of my head. It's an amazing, awesome song. And likewise, if you like what you heard, go support him and let the rest of the world know how awesome he is. All his other info can be found in the description. And we're gone. This is a mission, not a small time thing. Got me on a case like I'm Sherlock Holmes. My dome kind of messed up from what I've been seeing and what I've been hearing.